we're here. Hello. Um, <laughs> this is our first one. Lauren, when you look at this, don't go, oh my God, they took that long to get started. That's right. We did. You weren't here, so we weren't focused. You, you focus us. You scare us. All right. Example 23, we're using the data from that. So we've got the blue eyes, blonde hair, uh, and blue eyes and blonde hair percentages. So I'll just copy that and we'll go back over to this one. And I'll paste that up the top. There we go. Um, so example three, uh, 23, describe the incidence of blue hair, eyes and blonde hair in a population. What does the product rule formula show immediately that blue eyes and blonde hair? Or why does it show that it's not in and Remember what the product rules say. For them to be independent. A lot of mumbling going on. So probability of A times B. For it to be independent, what does it have to equal? Probability of A times B. Has to of B. You're all saying different things to me. A and B. And that would make it independent, would it? Okay. So we've got probability of A. Let's call that blonde hair. Times probability of B. I've found what it is. I've got to have my hand more pressed onto the screen. Otherwise, it sort of feels like I'm double pressing and it sort of tries to... Um, oh, I shouldn't have written it like that. Sorry, this is really bad writing. Sorry. Um, probability of A, probability of B equals 0.1. Uh, probability of... And then all of a sudden it starts to... Uh, a and B equals... Oh, that was the 0.1, sorry. That was 0.15, wasn't it? So the rule says the probability of A times probability of B equals probability of A and B. That makes it independent, does it? Why is probability of A probability of B the same Because I'm an idiot. Sorry. Just point out my stupidity, all right? That's what we need. So this would make it independent, correct? Yeah. Nate, you sound so excited. If that were correct, they would be independent. Yep, so 0 0.15 times 0 0.35 would give you 0 0.052, was it? Wow. I'm having lots of fun with my pen today already. I swear it's a new battery. Well, it's not really new, but uh, 5... Yeah, then we'll round up. 5.3, which does not equal 0 0.1. Therefore, not independent. Not independent. We happy with that? So, what would be the probability of having blue eyes and blonde hair if the two characteristics were independent? Well, you've already done that. So, so B, it would be 0 0.053. Uh, yes. Nice conversion there. I'm a fan. We happy with that? So, I will stop the recording on that one.